Hey guys, welcome to the speed series and what we're going to do, okay, we're going to work through each of the five main sources of power. Okay, so we've got hip rotation, torso rotation, shoulder rotation, arm speed, hand speed, one day we're going to work on each. Alright, despite what you think and feel, alright, uh, somewhere between 60 and 80% of our speed is rotary speed. And because of that fact, what we're going to do is we're going to start in the core in the midsection. Reason for that being, okay, that to prevent injury, all right, but also to stabilize it, and that will allow our body to generate as much speed as possible. All right, first draw. I've got 10 pairs of socks here. Okay, remember we're looking at speed, so do these things at speed. What we're going to do, we're going to grab the sock, go down, do a sit-up. Okay, and then as we come up, we're going to throw that sock with two hands as hard as we can. Here we go. Or do the other side. Okay, next one very similar, but this time in our stance, in our golf posture. Okay, got this sock. All right, we're going to try and create as much rotary speed, really focusing on generating the speed from here. Okay, feel like your belly button is turning really hard. Here we go. Other side. Okay, and then finish up by grabbing a club, holding it at the wrong end, so you're swinging the grip end. I've got a club here with the club head off. Okay, and then make some swings as fast as you can. Again, really concentrating on rotating that core as fast as you can. Right, so let's do 10 reps of each exercise. Okay, and then complete three sets of that. Right, very important to take those same feelings into swinging the golf club at the end. That's the critical part. Let's train our body for speed. Let's train our muscles for speed, starting with that core section.